We gonna act like we never fucked up. Like it's the first time. We ready? But um, yeah, she 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 the intern. Like I'm teaching her how to be an audio engineer. Cause before it was just fucking me. I'd be walking back and forth. But she the one. She's she's the one. No cap. All right, let's go. Let's get it. Oh, my God. Boom, we in this bitch. Number one podcast on the motherfucking earth. And today, we got my mans, my homie, Leek on the come up. What it is. <laughs> Thank you for coming on the show today, my nigga. This is, this is the first take, nigga. We, we did not mess up. It's like, no, how you feeling today? Cooler, cooler. That's good, that's good. I'm glad to hear you sound better this time on the mic. Yeah. <laughs> What's up with you? How was the week? Man, trying pretty normal, steady, trying to make some money. What's a, what's, what's a normal Monday for Lee going to come up? Uh, you hear you never listen to my music? Yeah, I'd listen to your music. All right, then I'm out on a block every day early morning. Touche. Yeah. I guess, I mean, nigga, when do you brush your teeth, nigga? Like, you can't just say that. <laughs> <laughs> you don't really say anything. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I mean, at nighttime, then I wake up in the morning. I what the hell? The Y'all hear your man? <laughs> It's cause you got some diamonds in your mouth. You don't need to do it. You on that rich nigga time, nigga. You were like, fuck, I do it, and I do it when I go to bed. <laughs> but um. <laughs> dummy, I'm not. I might. I'm not gonna refill the cup, dummy. I'm not gonna refill the cup. Fuck out of here. But um, leak on the come up has broken the record today. Out of all the interviews, he brought the most niggas. This bitch looking like a goddamn concert for fucking Travis Scott. But um, shout out Meech over there. This nigga, this nigga did not know who I was. He was like, nigga, I don't know you. I was like, nigga, you don't know me? He's like, oh, all right. <laughs> I see this nigga on the block damn near every other day. This nigga still ain't know me this whole time. Shit crazy, bro. Shit crazy. <laughs> it's like, no, it's cool, though. We know how that should be. We ain't seen each other since fucking middle school. We look hella different. Nigga did not have all that goddamn North Face fur on his face he last knew, time. He knew who he was. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you might have bloopers, bro. I ain't gonna lie. It's not a blooper, bro. This is a, this is a first take. We didn't mess up. This is first take shit. I was gonna, I was gonna play like one of your songs in the beginning, but I'm like, do not want my shit to get copyrighted, you know. Oh, you good. Damn, I should have just asked you that. I should have, cause you can white. Did something just cut out? Oh, you heard that cut out? No. Maybe it's just my headphones. But um, all right, let's let's start this. Let's start the interview now, I guess. <laughs> um, where is Leak from to come up from? Leak wanna come up. I'm from. I ain't gonna lie, bro. You gotta give me like five. <laughs> you gotta give me five seconds, bro. You geeking, bro. I'm not geeking. I'm, I'm fucking chilling. I'm vibed out. What the fuck I look like, nigga? I'm chilling. This nigga, this nigga leak on the come up. Definitely brought the bling, nigga. I should have wore one of my fake chains or something. <laughs> just so I can, just so I can, just so I can, like, I know I, my shit probably gonna look different from yours. They gonna be like, yo, why his shit look so different from his? I'm just be like, my shit dirty. Oh. That's what I'm gonna say. It's like no, but all right, all right. Let's. I'm gonna start this question again. Um, no, as a matter of fact, I'm, I want to get into the way what where originally where you're from and stuff. Let's start with some more like, what is a what is a Friday like? Say it's Friday, you got paid, nigga. And you try and turn up with the boys. What's the move? Already paid it. I mean, yeah, Friday is like a normal person's, like, normal work person. We're not like, normal work people. You got to understand that. You just said you see us every day, right? Yeah, yeah. You feel me? So, every day payday, so you feel me? We going to go out on a Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday, or Thursday, and a Friday. Just like it's a Friday, so. So, what is the what is that day like? Like, do y'all, y'all go to the strip club? Like, y'all get some I prostitutes? I ain't going to lie. It get to the point where you don't even be on a point like, yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say the prostitutes. 
I ain't mean to say the prostitutes, bro. I'm like, we don't even worry about what day it is. I don't even gonna lie. I don't even know what day it is today. Nigga, today is Saturday. Saturday, Friday, the same thing. What the hell? Nigga, I had my Friday. We were supposed to go to the strip club Friday. I didn't even go because I ain't even gonna throw no ones. I'm like, them bitches. I, I knew the bitches that was going to be dancing there. That's why I was like, I don't even want to throw 50 bucks in there. Hope she don't see this. But no funny shit. What, what club you was going to go to? It's this new one. It's like uh, it's like this passionate clubhouse type shit. But I looked at it. Oh, yeah, they told me come down there. They when told you come down there and perform? I ain't slide. You How you knew them, though? Nigga, I, I interviewed the bitch. Them. I interviewed the girl. <laughs> <laughs> You gonna fuck me uh, up. Uh, all right, that's, I mean, I probably saw I'm gonna slide when you slide. We gonna go the same day. That's that's <laughs> tough. That's a deal. Cause I ain't I ain't gonna lie. That's that's not. I'm not. Uh, I'm supposed to be interviewing again, so I'm not gonna say nothing about it. <laughs> but um, so you never answer my question. Like what you do? Like what's the what's the regular day for leak on the come up? You say getting money tra- on the block. Like, like that's it. You don't, yeah, look, 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 look. you don't go, I'm a, you don't I'm go a to bust, the... I'm going to bust everything down to you, for real. Normal day, for real, you feel me? I'm going to wake up to my son, you feel me? Oh, you do, you, you got baby mother, so that's, I mean, you do got child. Congratulations. Yeah. I appreciate it, bro. I should have brought him in here. Yo, that'd be so me? hard, bro. It wouldn't have been, though. He'd have been all over the place. Oh. How old is he? He won. Jeez. How, yeah. what, 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 what was your mental space when you was, in, when you, a year ago? I mean, to be honest, I, I ain't gonna lie. I was already prepared for it for real because I had already been through the stage where I was like, yeah, I don't want this. I ain't want this. You gotta get rid of that. You feel me? So, yeah, I wanna really keep on doing that. I give him credit. And that's good. Um, that's, that's congratulations again. Yo, you gotta, we, got, we can hear like when you put shit on the table. Um, so, all right, so every, you wake up to your son. Finish what you were saying. Wake up to my son. I ain't want. We being honest, man. Uh, I just we we try and get to know Leak on the come up. What is a regular Wednesday for Leak on the come up like? A Wednesday now. <laughs> <laughs> so we talking hump day. Cause you talk, nigga. What? <laughs> Nigga, I'm talking about. You said every day was payday. Every day is a Friday, so I'm just picking any day at this point. Uh, man, so every day pretty much the same for her. I'm going to try to switch as much stuff up as possible so everybody don't know my route. You feel me? But like I said, I'm going to wake up to my son for real. You probably, you going to see me where you see me at for real, 5400. You feel me? If you know, then you know. You feel me? You know what I said? Yeah, I know what I said. Yeah, I, had to, I know I had to, you was looking up like you ain't know. I had to know. think. Yeah. I had to think. I had to think about the different uh-huh. blocks. Up there for real, you feel me? Is it like a is it like a King Von thing where it was like we from fifty fourth, we not from fifty third? This ain't King Von. Oh. This ain't King Von. But I'm just saying, is it like that though? As far as like it's like the block down, you don't fuck with them, but like the block y'all block is cool. No, we fuck with everybody. We fuck with everybody. Alright, cool. Alright, never mind it. Don't we don't, we we, we, at, we fuck with everybody over here. So finish what your regular day is like, nigga. We, we how long is it gonna take for us to get through this question? <laughs> what part of my day we at now? Nigga, I, thought, you, I, I thought I didn't told you what nigga, I did. You, say, you want you me to get the win out? I say, go in the house, I get the plan I'm not again, trying, go to I'm not, sleep. I'm not trying to say like what type of cereal you be eating type shit. I'm just saying like when, what you be doing, nigga. Like nigga, it's niggas out here that's bumping your music like damn this, I hope, like I want to know what this nigga like. Like that's what I'm trying to get out of you. Pull up on me. What? No, that is not what I'm trying to say. That's what I'm telling you. I try to tell you what I be doing. You, oh, you I want me I, pull up on you? So- no, I feel like I feel like I'm telling you what I be doing. Feel me? my life ain't that much interesting for real. But I ain't more interesting than yours for real. You feel me? Yeah, I feel I'm you. Just try and get a bag, brother. But like them bars don't come from living like in a regular ass nigga. What'd you say, me? Skip the question. Yeah, Skip the, the question. Person, bro. All right, skip the question. Skip the question. Um, you think there's a breakfast club? Bro, you try to get us him. I'm not bro. trying to get nobody. I'm just try, like I'm just a fan of Leak on the Come Up, and I know it's uh, dozens, hundreds, and thousands of people that feels the same way. 
And that's yeah. all I'm trying to get. I'm trying, they, they wish they can be in this room right now. If you would've saw, nigga, I, if you would've saw what I saw when you was, I was on the phone with you, and you was like, yeah, I'm here, you don't see me. I, I'm like, yo, well, what is these niggas doing? I, I just saw like five niggas. I'm like, <laughs> what the fuck? I, I ain't gonna lie, I thought I was about to bank me. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, I just, I, I don't know why I knew it was y'all. Like, that shit was crazy. I just haven't seen that in a while. From, Cause I'm out the county now, I'm ducked right. off. That's why I just haven't, I haven't, I have like, I have, I've been so out of the loop. Right. <laughs> Especially with you. Hell yeah. And it's a lot of shit that we can <clears throat> learn from there. Yeah. So, we talked about, we, before, before we fucked up, we was talking about, you was from, you said Rogers? Yeah, Rogers. And you said your first time you ever started on some music shit, your godmother took you to the studio when you was 11? Yeah. Um, and you said... So so what so what is that next step? What is that next? What do you feel like that next big move was from eleven? Uh, <clears throat> I mean, at first for real, my cousin had came to me for real for real. I forgot why he came to me, but he was trying to look for a studio. I wanted to go into the studio with him for real. I was probably like six. I mean, seventeen. Yeah, seventeen. I went to my man Garza's studio for real, and I did this song. And then ever since then, I just kept doing music for real. What was what was your mental state? What was what the shit you was into when you were seventeen when you made that first song? Nothing, nigga. That, that nothing. Yeah, you ain't hear that song. I didn't hear that first song. I know. So you didn't put it out. So you didn't put I out did, the first no, song. No, I did put it out. I'm saying like as the songs go on and on, you start to hear how you feel me. Shit start getting real. Oh, so you saying like you saying like your uh, you saying that. Your music, like from start from the bit from your first song to your most recent song, is literally like a diary to your shit. Yeah, ain't that how it's supposed to be? Uh, I never, me. I, me personally, listen to your music. I never really thought of it that way. Yeah, it's supposed to ever be in every song. But it's but supposed now to be that a change. You know, now that you're saying that, it's like it makes more songs make sense now, type shit. So, all right, you said your first song, you're seventeen. What was the first song you put out? Was the first song you made that you put out that you said? The first song I made, yeah, I put that out. That's on SoundCloud. But what, when when did you start dropping your shit on like screaming platforms? When I was eleven. Like Spotify and shit? No, SoundCloud. I'm not talking about SoundCloud. I'm talking about like when you oh. start dropping your shit on Spotify. That's a streaming Spotify. platform. No, so. Been really not a stream a streaming platform. No, oh, my no, brother. I just started streaming on this probably like last year. But you a mixtape ass nigga. Yeah. So, tell me about your Spin Rilla era. Nah, I don't even remember for real. I don't remember nothing about Spin Rilla. How old are you now? Twenty one. Twenty one. We are the same age. What the fuck is this? It's a studio in here. Nigga, outside. that's you? Nigga, I thought that was coming from his phone. Oh, oh hell no. Yo, meat <laughs> stories be fucking killing me. <laughs> Yo, this nigga meat, this nigga, this nigga witnessed fucking two crackheads fighting today. That shit is so crazy to me. Like, nigga, where you be yet? Like, <laughs> you be over east or some shit, nigga. <laughs> Oh hell no! That should be crazy, bro. That should be crazy. <laughs> All right, so tell me about what age did you start taking this shit serious? Wait, 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 wait. No, no, let's not. Let's we 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 at, we at about seventeen. So we about we about getting at that age when you started like when when do you, do do you consider yourself like do you consider yourself like quote unquote a man now? Nigga, I'm. A <clears throat> He about to say some shit. Chris, you killing me these questions. Bro. I'm not. I'm just. I'm just trying to figure out who leak on the come up is. Yo, this ain't quote unquote. Yeah, not been a man. I'm just saying. Yeah, you right. Niggas, 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 but niggas, nigga had to look me in my eyes type shit when you said that. Yeah, you just not play my gangsters. I'm not trying to play with your gangsters. Yeah, quote unquote. Been <laughs> <laughs> Try and press me type shit. I'm not trying to press you, nigga. You the realest nigga I know. <laughs> no cap. 
If I was dead, nigga, you'd be the realest nigga I knew. <laughs> <laughs> nigga shot me in my shit, nigga. You would be the realest nigga. You got the you got the crown, nigga. But you you got you got the streets. I don't got the streets, so that's a different type of real nigga. I don't know what to tell you. See, you and we in the two different lanes. I'm over here making podcasts. This nigga on the block. I got like that's two different worlds. So I'm not even gonna try to compare it. So do so. Are you are you willing to talk about your block experiences? Or are you just about to hit me with a no comment? No comment. Cause you digging deep. Yeah, like, I'm digging deep, nigga. We trying to figure out who leak on the come up is. Yeah, talk to me. I've been talking to you. You been hitting me next question, skip question. I'm not trying to get you indicted, nigga. You, I'm trying. We. I know me per me and you personally haven't talked in years. I'm trying to see what the fuck's been up. I know you've been rapping. Yeah. <clears throat> yep. <laughs> I don't know what this is. I don't know, bro. All right, so you want to? So it's okay if we talk about what, what was happening around your time when you had a child. Uh, oh yeah, when I had a child. Hold on. What? How old was you? You were twenty. Yeah, I'm trying to think. That's a little for a little step back for real. I'm trying to think. What was I doing? I probably was doing the same thing I'm doing right now. Like, mm-hmm. Is it like, is it like a, is it like a, ten year plan here? Or is just like this is just today and then that's tomorrow. This the day and this the month, the month, the month. I feel like that's the best way to live, honestly. Yeah, that's how everybody should live. Hell yeah, Man. I ain't planning for shit, nigga. This is what what I plan doing today is this right here. Yeah, so if you feel like you want to get rich today, try to get rich today. Don't be like, yeah, I'm going to get the 500K right now, and then tomorrow I'm making the 500K, you feel me? Because then tomorrow you going to be stiff if anything happen. You fuck that 500K up. The f- yeah. You. I think I think you would be good at cameos. Like, don't you know the app? No. It's like a, it's like an app where, like, celebrities go in there, then, like, you can pay, like, John Legend and be like, happy birthday, Jake. Hmm? Like I could like I can go on this app and then I could pay like a, a celebrity like John Legend or something and then I'd be like hey say this in a video and then he'll make a video like hey sh- happy birthday Uncle T he be they be doing shit like that I don't know if it's John Legend specifically but that's what it is basically I could see no, you doing I ain't that never seen, I ain't never seen that before. I get you saying happy birthday like hey you it's, this your accent right here like yeah dummy happy birthday to little Shanisha I hope you turn up for your twenty <laughs> first. <laughs> I see you doing that, bro. We need that Baltimore accent on Cameo. Uh, I'm gonna get on there. <laughs> so let's talk about let's talk about Leak gonna come up a little bit more. How how do you how if I don't I don't really personally I don't compare you to nobody as far as like Baltimore rappers coming out type shit. But how yeah. do you feel about that? I feel like that's you got a good a good uh, thought on how you want to carry that. That's Big. how you supposed to carry. It. Cause nigga, like, just like watching your music videos, that's a movie by itself. Let alone listening to actual songs, you know. Right. So, tell me about more so when you started getting into the music video bag. I ain't gonna lie, I'm really start getting into it more so right now. For real, a lot of my videos don't even really probably even relate to the the, the what's going on to the song. For real, you feel me? It's just a bunch of. Yeah, do this song for real. We already getting this video on, yeah. I was looking at one of your videos. I'm like, these niggas standing <clears> on the truck. What video? It was some video. You were standing on the truck with your niggas. I probably was. I probably was. That's more slimy. You talking about uh, that one with him and Nick? Yeah. Yeah, that probably was. How did you, what the fuck, you got a truck in your garage or something? A truck in my garage? Because, like, where did that truck come from? Oh, no, that's my man shit. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, that's my man shit. I know so, do you just be, like, just be, like, thinking of some any other shit? Where you, like, how, tell me, tell me, your, I, do you go, do you make the ideas in your music videos? I'm ready to start. I don't want want to say yeah for real and then people go back to it and be like damn your thought process like your your creativity level on zero i don't i ain't looking my i ain't had my videos 
planned out for the uh, uh, songs yet for real. I'm just starting to be that real. Just start doing that. You really start seeing the difference in my next video. Mm. <clears throat> so you got some videos about to come out. Can you give me like an exclusive, like what's about to drop? I'm ready to do a video to, uh, I got this, got this song ready to come out called The Squid. It, it's to a squid game beat for real, but it's going to be called Red Light Green. Like, I saw that shit. Yeah. I'm ready to that shit going to be hard. Did y'all hear the full version already? Of course. What y'all think? I know y'all got the leaks. I just hit a bone. Just hit the bone. So, <clears throat> so do you, do you want do you want to dedicate one one of your niggas to come over here and come talk about you? Yeah, they can do that. Which one? You got pick a leak gonna come up. Cause you brought you brought an audience today, nigga. It usually just be me and Wap. Uh, who wanna come up here and talk that shit? I, me personally, I feel like Meech is the best candidate, but uh, <laughs> Meech ain't gonna look you in your eyes. Yeah. You saying you want me to stay right here? He can stay right there. He gonna come right here. Matter of fact, matter of fact, um, if he probably, he probably just gonna stand over the mic where you at and just drag it over there. Nigga, come over here. Don't sit down. Come over here. Bring that chair over here. Drag it over here. So now, on the camera, who you looking for? You looking at W, what, your Instagram, WB underscore Meech. Nigga, that's how you spell it. That's what it is. That's who you looking at. So tell me how you met Lee going to come up. Mm, my brother, we been in middle school. Mike right here. Say so my brother, we been in middle school. Oh, y'all been close since then? Been a lot, been. You was dead, bro. <laughs> I was, I was dead, but I didn't. I middle school with it, so you definitely like you should know those. But I, I know I was dead, but I'm still like, like there's still people that don't know that. You know what I mean? Right. So it's like niggas trying to figure out what meat gonna like. Then plus you brought a fucking entourage in here. I got a question one of them know, type it's shit. Really not an, mm -hmm. It's really not an entourage, bro. Like I, if I, you see right here, this really us. Like this, this you gonna see every time. Like you not gonna see no, no bio that's not outside the game. No, no, no bullshit. Okay, so do you call do you call this uh, OCU? Yeah. O S U O C U O C U O C U O C U on the come up. Oh, that's what it stand up on the come. Oh, I did not think of that. I didn't think of that. So who thought of that? That O C U. You thought of that? Yeah, my brother, my little brother had came up with my name. We gonna come up for real. Let me stretch it out. The O C U for real made it more than what it was. All right, so 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 Meech, we we both we both know that it was it was hella rappers and all that shit from Baltimore coming up when we was in middle school and all that. So what made you think about Leek? That was like made you want to stick with him. Like, is it just a is it just the music for real, or is it just like his character, like the way he stands? No, I mean it's just character for real. Like, even if you even if bro wasn't no rapper or not like that, you feel me? And we were just some just some random like anybody out, out like outside for real. That's still gonna be my man for real. Like, I'm still gonna rock out with him like. No matter if he rapped or didn't rap, went broke, got rich, it don't matter. We been locked in. It's a loyalty, a loyalty over everything. You feel me? It's gonna take you a long way. Okay, okay, so okay. so since this nigga obviously don't have a good explanation on how y'all spend y'all turn up days, do you have a better explanation? Cause he, cause the, I, I'm predicting y'all be together a lot. Like you said, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, the same shit. It's like, it's like, it's like we don't think about what we gonna do for real. It's like we like be outside. Niggas be like, well, let's go here, let's go here, something like that. But not let's not in the plant. Like he got performance, or he got a show, we got an interview, or something like that for real. Other than that, we just let's just come like to the head. We like, shit, we just need to do this for real. So do you have like a go to like you go to the strip club or some shit? No, we definitely fuck the strip club, but <laughs> you feel me? Like that's not like that's not nothing to be excited about because like we know we did that shit all the time. So, so y'all yo y'all y'all some strip club ass niggas. What? No, not really for like <laughs> <laughs> No, like not no strip club name, but like ain't nothing wrong with the strip club though, but Ain't nothing wrong with the strip club. I'm just saying, like most, most, like not saying most niggas, but most niggas, they, they get, they, they get that bag for the day and they fucking throw some ones. Like that's a go to. That's what I do. You saying uh, BMF? Hell yeah. We the Fifty Boys. No kidding. Oh! <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> niggas said the original Fifty Boys. No, we the Fifty Four Boys though. Jeez. Seriously. 
Shout out 50 Cent. That shit hard. I need to let me let me come be like let me I don't know. Let me come let me, we all we all fucking kidnap a baby or some shit. Let me let me take care of it type shit. They ain't even really kidnapped for real. Just for the ice cream and shit. Kidnapping somebody, going in the trunk and shit like that. Put a bag with their head. Nigga, let me, let me fucking, let me. I don't know. Let me, let me. I don't know. Let me do something. Let me be the assistant. Let me do the calls. I'm trying to get. I'm trying to get that fifty boy bag, fifty four boy bag. Mm-mm-mm. But that's that's hard, bro. That's hard, bro. But um, thank you, Meech, for coming in and talking about leak on the come up. All right, appreciate it. All right, you can go back to the mic. Uh. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I said I wasn't gonna refill my cup. I'm thinking about it, bro. I'm thinking about it. I'm just thinking about it. All right, so do you remember the process when you was like, I'm about to drop an album, your first album? No matter of fact, take me back to it. You said you was on, you, you, you said, but you said you don't remember nothing about Spinrilla. No, I really don't for real, but I was just on there the day just so happily. I was trying to go look at how uh, the views and shit. My man's had it for real, so I went on there. I think the last thing I dropped on there was like the first reality. I'm on reality three now. Hell yeah. <clears throat> but you drop you dropped the first realities on like Spotify and shit, don't you now? Yeah, everything on uh, all platforms. I think my favorite yeah, I think I think the second one my favorite one honestly. The second one? Yeah. I think the second one honestly. But I don't know. I kind of like I'm I'm that kind of fan where like I listen to that one song I fuck with and I'm like yo he can't top this like no matter right. how good it is. Right. Do you feel like that? Yeah, it's a couple songs that I ain't gonna lie. It's songs that I thought was the hardest song and then time time go past and then I'm like no nah, this song hard no nah, this song hard so I ain't gonna lie it's always gonna be a song I feel like the hardest at the moment but not top hardest forever you feel me. Mm. Okay, good. <clears throat> so, I know you just dropped this. I know you just dropped this album. But like, when is like, what is the like? How do you, how do you? Matter of fact, before we start to like put albums, how do you go into the studio like when, before you make a song? Like, what what was that one song you was like? Um, you just dropped it. You you had on in a music video. You had on some shorts. And some motherfucking um, compression pants. Sure. You just dropped it, the last one, bro. You gotta remember this. Oh no, facts, right? Yeah, facts. yeah, yeah, yeah. So tell me, like, when you go in the studio, like, do you go in the studio thinking facts, or do you just go in there and be like, I'm just going to try to make some shit? I ain't gonna lie. Whatever beat, if I'm listening to a beat for real, some beat gonna catch me. Whatever beat catch me for real, I, it sound like I already be hearing the words on there for real. I already be knowing. Exactly what to say on there for real, for real, nigga. But I ain't gonna lie, I really do feel like if if it was somebody feel me that really fuck with music for real, niggas fuck around be saying close or similar words or on the same type of flow, same beat type shit like that for real, just off how the sound sound. You feel me? Cause I ain't gonna lie, you 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 to me personally like. You already a Baltimore legend to me. Like it's no like it's, I interviewed Baltimore rappers before. Like nigga, I was waiting for this interview type shit. Like yeah, niggas right. not fucking with you. Like that's yeah, why right. I wanted to interview you. Just cause like not even just not even just cause you be having the hits like type shit. Cause you actually like nigga, I, you you saw where I fucking had to come to see you at for the interview. Right. Like you see that, so it's just like it's just like I don't know, like some poo shiesty shit. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but. All right. So what? What do you have? Do you, so like I don't know. Like I don't know what the acts leak on to come up because like you almost you a mysterious ass nigga. Like you don't just post what you your your personality type shit. So I'm like it's a lot to ask you. Like nigga, do you drink coffee or some shit? Like I don't know. <laughs> no, I don't drink coffee. What's your what's Who your favorite? You drink coffee? What's your favorite drink? You like a soda ass nigga? You be drinking water? No, I don't drink no soda. You don't drink no soda. Mm-hmm. What you a vegan? No, vegans don't drink soda. No, it's just like it sounded like you was in that mood. Nigga, I got Burger King in that corner. That's mine. Oh, that's Burger King. I definitely thought y'all. <laughs> I definitely thought y'all pulled up with some McDonald's. Not gonna cap. That still would make that's me not a vegan. Mm-hmm. Okay, so you're not a vegan. Okay, good. Um, is Leek to come up a ass eater? Whoa. We trying to get your personality, nigga. <laughs> Oh no, I ain't the terminal nigga personality. Yes, it is. It's gonna tell a lot about you, bro. 
don't know. <laughs> I know, I know. Meech be eating ass though. <laughs> <laughs> we can turn that speak up a little more. Y'all said y'all can't hear it, right? Mm-mm-mm. But um, um, that's so you're not gonna answer that. I said no, I'm not. You don't eat ass? No. Whoa. You do, bro. Yeah. Show you. I be eating ass, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> no cap, nigga. <laughs> No cap, <laughs> nigga. You, so, all right, all right, all right. Let's talk about. Let's talk about. Uh, can we talk about baby mama? Uh, about what? Anything. Like, how did you meet her? Like, is she is she your wife or some shit? Like, let me know. We trying to figure out because we 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 just found this niggas that's watching this interview that just found out you had a son. Yeah, that's my wife. Your man's at the door. The producer. My engineer. Your engineer. He here? Yeah. You send him to Addy? That's my nigga. Nigga, this is yeah, supposed to be an off the cut in spot. Y'all keep coming in here. You can go get him, bro. I ain't gonna go lie. How long? No, no, listen. How long the interview is now, though? We on 30 minutes, so we probably gonna be on for like 10, 15 minutes more. He outside, though. He's like, regardless, bro. He ain't cold as fuck. Like, like, yeah, it is cold as a bitch. Go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. That, that's that's one of that's one of the leak shooters right there walking across the camera. It's like, no. <laughs> you, gotta turn the, you gotta turn the door and I'll handle up. No, it's recorded. It's not live. It's not live. We, I'm gonna, I was probably gonna drop. Um, do you have like when do you when are you gonna drop some shit? Cause I was gonna try to drop this interview around then. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't dropping again until like the winter. The winter, niggas already the winter. It's cold as a bitch outside. All right, well, yeah, like next month. Next month, December. All right, do you want Do you want me to just drop your interview like next Monday type shit, or you want me to drop your interview around then when you about to drop some shit? That's what I was thinking. Drop it this month for real. Drop it around like a little bit before Thanksgiving. Cool. Deal. All right. When is Thanksgiving, nigga? The 25th, right? The 25th, right? So you want me to do it like that Monday? Well, that's Christmas. Fuck, no. Nigga, that's Christmas. Thanksgiving's on the 25th. The 24th. 24th. Yo. Yeah, Chris. Yes, you said what? Just though. Just though? And nigga, I don't know where you gonna sit at. You gonna sit over there in that corner. Nigga, you really broke the record today. It ain't nobody that know. No, 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 bro, 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 bro. That corner. <laughs> he about to fuck the camera up. <laughs> you the, you nigga, you broke the record, nigga. You got the producer here. I kinda wanna talk to the producer. Hey, can you get on camera, bro? You look like Pooh Shiesty right now with the ski mask. Come over here. You can bring the chair over here to this mic. We got, you said Justin? Justo. Justo? Yeah, two O's. Justo. We got Justo in this bitch. The producer of Leak to Come Are you, are you the producer of Leak to Come Up? I'm the engineer. You the engineer. So you, so you, damn, I didn't even know that, bro. See, this is the type of shit you need to bring up. I'm over this, I'm over this bitch trying to interview him. You over this bitch like skip question, no comment. <laughs> what question did I say? Like two of them, y'all. I didn't know that, right? I didn't know that. So tell me, so you the engineer, just though. I got, I got at least two, three questions for you. First question: What is the regular time that leak on the come up hit you? Like, yo, I'm trying to record. Shit. Talking to this. Oh, <laughs> shit, niggas get it in whenever for real, but you know, niggas got lives and shit. Niggas like to do the late night shit. Um, I think most of our best sessions be late night, though. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Overnight, fucking graveyard shit type shit. She's overtime. So, so how? So leak? So he? How do when you, when you be? I don't know how to act this. When you when leak when leak pull up and you there and you get you getting everything ready. What is this? What is this nigga doing? Is he eating Skittles? Is he fucking charging his phone? Like I need to know. He getting in that mode to wash some shit down. You feel me? Niggas pull up, might listen to some beats, smoke a blunt, talk. If I ain't seen niggas or something like that, but usually niggas come in, niggas get right to it. You feel me? Like it, it don't matter who in the studio. When yo coming that bitch, yo lock in. Don't matter what's going on. How many people could be me and him? He be, be having everybody. bitches in there. Look, man, you gotta ask him that. I don't. 
Oh, never mind, never mind. Next comment, next question, next question. <laughs> next question. I see, I can see it in his eyes. Yeah, it be bitches in there, but they don't be mine. That's a good answer. Come on, yo, it's the studio. Hit the round of you know applause what's one more time. On in the studio. You know how the studio is. That's a good answer, Leek, on the come up. But all right, so you said he be getting that he ready to lock in. Like, do you do he always? Is it like a is it like a thing that you know about him? Like, is it like a thing that like every time he come in, you know he gonna do this? Smoke. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't, you feel me? That's about it. I know niggas gonna burn that bitch. That's that's all that nigga need to really do for real. Mm -hmm. What's your favorite song about Leek gonna come up? Um. Right now, I think my favorite song, Papa Flow, for real. Is That's that out? Yeah. Yeah, I think I figured I heard that. I heard that. It's on Reality Creep for real. That's my, that's my favorite song right now. If I had to say one, but everything, I ain't even gonna lie. Come to the mic. Everything is is official for real. You feel me? I can't even really say I got too many songs that's favorite because I bump everything. So, so how? Let's talk about you as an engineer. Like, when did you start engineering? And how did you meet Leek on the um, first answer? How did you meet Leek? I met Leek at the old studio I was working at down the street. I probably started engineering though about four years ago, like around this time, 2017. Um, and you was working in the studio when you met him. Yeah, I wasn't working at the studio I'm at now. Did you go to like school? I, to, nah. you so, I ain't gonna say completely self-taught because I had, you feel me? I had help on the way. I had people show me. I was how just, to do certain shit, but no, I ain't go to school. I was just asking because I was trying to get a job at the studio before, and they was asking me about a resume and shit. Like, how did you get in that bag? I kind of fell into that shit for real. I ain't going to lie. Everything just kind of worked out like that. Um, I had met somebody. I had met a couple people you need for this? real, and they kind of introduced me to one studio. Then the people I met at that studio introduced me to somebody who put me in the studio that I met him at, mm -hmm. which was pimp shit for real. You can I see you sweating, nigga. You can cut that switch on. Oh, no, nah, you good. Nigga, you hot. Get that switch right behind you, Meech. <laughs> 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 I got you, bro. Hey, nigga, I got all this shit on, but, but yeah, you. like, I don't, when I met him, that was, that was that pimp shit. Like I said, I worked there for like a year, and then he, I didn't even think niggas was going to fuck with me when I left. You feel me? Cause mind you, he wasn't he wasn't my my client. Yeah, I had just I think I think he couldn't be there one day or something. The, the nigga who was was um you usually recording, recording him. him. Yeah, he couldn't be there. I pulled up, met him. There was a couple other people with him. Then when I went to the other studio, yo just came through one day on the humble, and niggas just locked in. Then he was uh, locked in with my cousin shooting videos and shit. So everything kind of just made sense at the time. And then, like like the studio I'm at now is the best studio in the city. So what studio is it? It's called Art. It, it was called Architects. Now it's called Hitman. Oh yeah. Um, I like that studio. Yeah. Best studio, no bias, but best studio in the city. You feel me? Yeah, I fuck with that studio. Shout so, out Hitman. Yes sir. Shout out Notch, Mike. Um, I don't know if you know them for real. I don't know him personally. But uh, yeah. When I think when he heard the sound and shit. Yo probably was just trying to lock in. We already knew each other, so niggas already had a relationship. But, yeah, that's really how it started. I ain't go to no school. And what what, what made you feel like, what what is, what is what, what do you feel like that special thing about Leek on the come up is? It like, yo, I'm going to lock in with this nigga. Was it just like he paying me type shit? I mean, like me, nah. See, that's the thing. This shit ain't, it's not about money. You feel me? It, shit got to get paid for, but it's, it's a, like you said, it's about believing in somebody and saying, like, like, like me said, yo, the one. And I could see that. I could see niggas worth e work ethic. I could see niggas wanted it for themselves. You feel me? Nigga hungry. And nigga just kept that shit going. You feel me? That shit not easy, bro. So Man. how long, how long, no homo, how long is this relationship between the engineer and Lee going to come up? Been? Like two, three years now. Damn, that's a, that's more Something than me like and that. Shorty, nigga. I got more loyalty than me. That's how it's supposed to be, though. You I'm, I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. That's Yo, that's my girl over there. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, nah, you you uh, what I was saying, but yeah, like a couple years for real. I'm a lot in tip.
but um, like I was saying, like yo really is the one though, bro. Like, and I it's was not just about, telling them it's not about no money or nothing like that. Like if I could do that shit for free, I would. It's not about that. It's just about me personally. I want to see the niggas around me win, and niggas who want to win for themselves. That's that's all I want. If I see you want to win for yourself, I'm a work. I'm a fuck with you. That's all it's about, and that's how it's supposed to be. I was just telling him like to me, he's already a Baltimore legend type shit. Like, yeah. I, I, it's not, it's not. I just not know nigga. Like nigga, I rap myself, and I can tell him like, yo, you that nigga. Like, yeah. I could tell him that type shit. But thank you, Justo. Shout out Justo. Do you just specifically record him? Uh, I say now, like yeah, like he one of the only people I'm really locked in with still. Um, I recorded pretty much everybody in the city before. But, you know, like, as far as the studio goes, people locked in with the other engineers that's there, too. It's a couple other engineers there, too, but... Any shout-outs to the local engineers out here? Ty Pacino. Ty Pacino. I got a shout-out, Ty. That's my brother. Shout-out. Um, I ain't going to do too much picking and choosing, but just Ty, Naj, Mike, you feel me? Naj, Naj, he really got me right on the engineering tip. And he, I don't know if you, you say you don't know him personally, but... He really the best engineer in the city. You feel me? Been doing this shit for 20 years, so I got to shout him out, too. You feel me? Other than that, everybody else doing their thing, too. Everybody who doing their thing know what they doing. But cool. Yeah. That's a deal. Uh, Shout out Justo. Make sure... Um, make sure you got my Instagram. You can, cause I'm trying to put your shit in the in the bio. I'll give it to you after this. But right, cool. shout out Justo, the producer, the engineer, the the fucking nigga that's hitting the buttons for leak on the come up. You can, you can go back over there, go to my butt. Um, but sit in that corner over there. Though, yeah, I'm not trying to put you in the corner like you're in timeout type shit. It's just fucking compartmentalizing this bitch. It's hella niggas over here. Like nigga, when I ain't gonna lie, nigga, you pulled up with all them niggas. I'm like, at first when you when I called you. And there was niggas walking in front of you. I'm like, oh, maybe he's just walking down the sidewalk or some shit. And this nigga, and those niggas he's walking in with. I'm like, what you just did a drill, nigga? Uh, uh, I thought you then y'all all wearing black. Like <laughs> something is not right. <laughs> he looked like he the driver, nigga. He the only one not in black. <laughs> oh, I look. Oh, but um, yeah. But how you how you feel about the team? We strong. That's I need a little bit more than that. Uh, we how I feel about the team. That's my guys for real. They like family. Everybody that's with me like family. family. Would you say that this is the team right here? Yeah, it's a few people that's not here for real, but yeah, everybody right here, they family. How did you meet Nick? Is he in a team? Yeah. I met him through uh I met him through uh Let me see. What was the first time I met Nick? Oh yeah, I met Lil Nick when they was at the barber shop. They used to be at the barber shop. Okay. What when was that type shit? When was it? I don't know how many like how long ago it was for real. It probably was about two, three years ago, probably like three years ago. I met Nick. Probably like two. Shout out Young Nick. I'm, I'm, you need to tell him personally, like, yo, come on this nigga podcast. I'm trying to give him an interview. Yeah, he was going to come up here today. I don't know where he was at. Yo, if you if you want to, we, you can call him. I'll plug him up. We'll talk to him real quick. They can hear him. You, you got might as well court? bring him in here. You going to call him? I was saying you might as well bring him in here for real. Like, actually bring him in here. Yeah, I was still going to do that. Yeah. Oh, well, you say you want to talk to him? I want, oh. I'm just on him just, just for right now type shit. Hold up, nigga. I'm not ready. I got to get this shit ready. Ha- hand her that, hand that green bag. Yeah, he pass it over here. Oh, wait, wait. Um, Is it a white piece over there? Hand me that white piece right there. I know one of y'all see it. 